breaking of my teeth dates to my second grade. Uh, that's basically uh, probably year 1980 when I was eight years old or 1979 when I was eight years old is when they already have recorded uh, at Osnona Shola Gurum, that's a grammar school of Novo Mesto, they recorded the first visitations of Novo Mesto police officers as well as mainly uh, Milan Kuchan with uh, Gregor Golovich to this location here. So if this is a city of Novo Mesto like it is, and it's not that Novo Mesto police would not know or something like that, uh, they just made it totally, totally impossible for the truth to come out. I will explain. And so this here, this was our house here, which says here, uh, gray, green and fun apartments, whatever that is. And the school here, would be this school, a grammar school Gurum. And so if you would go and you would zoom yourself into this area here, you can see the school. It's a pretty big grammar school. But behind this school, they had two things. They have, uh, they had a psychologist department inside where I would be sent as a child already, Milan Kuchan sent me as a child in here. He had a teachers, they would constantly send me here, where they would find nothing wrong with me. And another thing they had here, they had a dentist by the name Schedel. And this dentist, as well as everybody else inside of this little dentist, dental home, right here in front of this grammar school germ recorded everybody recorded Milan Kuchan at my age nine demanding dentists to break my teeth okay let me be a little bit more explanational about this issue uh, there were two things that were happening in my early life when it comes to dentists just as I explained, not entirely, and hair cutters. The hair cut for the hair cutters, I explained already since I was a baby, I had a very long hair because the hair cutters uh, they would use the scissors to literally um, threatened me they're gonna cut my ears that was one of the things and that was uh, a hairstylist Zlata that was also Milan Kuchan involved in it and the second thing they would go and they would and scratch and a little bit with the scissors deliberately uh, pinch I don't know how you say that uh, at the dentist, however, Milan Kuchan was totally, totally insane. He became totally insane about the dentist practice. And it was so great, the dentist practice. He had uh, Gregor Golovich observe, like a police officer, everything that went on with me. And so when I came to the dentist, but it would take an order and order you to come they had them witness the stuff dentists did to me and uh, this dentist began to that was Dr. Schedel and there was some other dentist uh, there were actually like two or three dentists deliberately drill into the roots into the root channel uh, into the nerve from the tooth causing extremely painful injury and repeatedly I would have to come to this fucking dentist 
uh, you're not talking about one visit, you're talking about over, uh, I should say dentists, because Dr. Schedel was only one, and they had some other dentist, which I think it was not even from Slovenia, probably from Serbia or maybe some other Yugo state, uh, and uh, it became, at my age, at, at my age eight, it became a torture practice drilling literally into, uh, into a nerve. During MK Ultra, my father had to deliver me into, to these dentists. They started to fuck with me, death threaten, and so on and so forth. So this was one of the first MK Ultra dental breaking dent dents. Uh, situations I encounter in my life at age eight. That's how early breaking of the teeth, literally by the dentist, performed by the dentist, is supposed to give me a plomb, plombium, uh, a filling, the fill to fill the the hole in the teeth. And so they drilled and they drilled literally through the into the nerve to cause pain, to cause harm. Uh, and then they cemented the teeth, and then again they took the uh, cement out during MK Ultra. They started to fuck with that stuff. It goes to the H8. That's one thing. So how it all began, how it all started with the Milan Kuchan. Everybody observed Milan Kuchan. Everybody observed Novo Mesto police officers that. How the fuck can I even express myself? Rampage that building, interrogated, threatened dentists, uh, dental technicians, terrorized them, demanded to comply with it. The same shit happened at the General Hospital Novo Mesto, at the dental department of Novo Mesto. The same shit was recorded once I grew up and I was transferred to the uh, uh, to this Drausteni Dom, Novo Mesto. The same shit went on. Entire hospital have seen Milan Kuchan Everybody, everybody got to witness Milan Kuchan inside of the Zdravstveni Dom, Novo Mesto, where he would. Uh, that's where the interesting part comes. You remember when I mentioned Dr. Galatz? Well, Dr. Galatz was, uh, whatever, otorino laryngologist. Uh, this was a different type of uh, physician. Uh, he was specialized into surgeries of the Pojiranic, uh, I don't know how you say this. Goltanets uh, Pojiranic. Um, oral. Uh, organs surgeon uh, and so he performed the surgery on me when I was like I, I don't know I probably was also at a very young age uh, maybe <laughs> I don't even know I was maybe 10 years old maybe that was like a 4th grade I would say 10 years old and 
the thing about it is entire hospital knew about me. Entire hospital became involved in me in, in this case. I was nine years old. And they wanted to fucking kill me. There were Serbs working in there, all kinds of people. Uh, and this was like uh, a military institution, same like a fucking YLA, Yugoslavenska Narodna Armia. It was like a base, like a military base. <laughs> uh, I mean, yeah, the mentality inside was just like this. And, you know, when the order came from Josip Broz Tito, somebody like a Milan Kuchan, to do something like this, uh, you know, you can just cross yourself out. You don't exist anymore. Uh, after the surgery Galas performed on me, uh, I had a problem with my teeth that would not come out. Probably because of what went on uh, during the childhood. Uh, I had a problem with the teeth coming out. The teeth were so strong that they would just not come. Up, they would just not come out, and there were second teeth that were coming from beneath, and the teeth would not come out. Yeah, anyhow. Uh, before that, it was a play with the dance, uh, with the feeling, with with uh, uh, with the plumps. Let me let me explain what exactly do I. Uh, so I, I think that this is a, you know, this kind of stuff. That this is a plumbium, we say, because it's a. Uh, material that is that used to be used was a plumbium um sweetness, sort of um, the thing is that uh, because of the violence that went on you know, i would uh, request to be taken care of at this zdravstveni dom and what will happen is they would deliver me during MK Ultra, where there will be a chua of the dentists uh, that would simply. Uh, there was a dentist also that was not Slovenian, and the only thing that they would give a solidarity to him, and I was promised no, I was tortured during MK Ultra, again taken out, and breaking of the teeth started. By now, by one dentist, by every fucking dentist instead, guaranteeing me that when I come back to have in real time a dental work done, uh, this goes like to age. This goes mosquito. This goes to age twelve. I'm gonna say like twelve, eleven. Uh, it was so bad that I no longer would even want to come back anymore and I no longer wanted to use the dentist even with the with the problems with my teeth they fucked me up the teeth I would not want to come back anymore to the dentist uh, Milan Kuchan supervised this during MK Ultra and uh, was just simply allowing me to hear from the dentists the hell they unleashed on me and was laughing at me this was his specialty uh, and asking me if i heard if i heard you know, that was milan kuchan with uh, gregor golovic and the rest of the the clan whenever they were present but gregor golovic was specialized he's from novo mesto he was really specialized in this type of operations on behalf of milan uh, the best yet came when I had a problem with the teeth coming out and the teeth would uh, from beneath you know the second teeth when they grow and my teeth would not come out uh, that yet was the worst problem um, I didn't know what the fuck to do with it I was uh, it wasn't like with other kids uh, this teeth of mine would simply not come out i was already uh 15 years old i was already going to 
to the high school and the teeth would not come out and so father took me to Ljubljana and it's again where Milan Kucha traced me to the dentist uh, and again he was recorded he was recorded in Ljubljana he was recorded in Novo Mesto police uh, Zdravstveni dom. And what is the best about this novel mess about the Slovenian police? They enforced the crime. Then they went ahead and they investigated the crime by basically going from dentist to dentist, technician to technician. And according to their political Milan Kuchan, Borut Pahor, Janas Drnošek choice, they selected the dentists, the people that would be allowed to testify for me. So they, they basically went to, to create a complete political uh, ownership of this case. So there will be only the people that will be loyal to the coach and so on that could testify for me. In other words, they went ahead and they investigated. Then they went on and they started to suggest me that I have to recall this and stuff like that during MK Ultra, they were not shy about it. They suggested to go on and do it. So they do it in a such a disgusting way that that's a play with the sepsis. This is a play with the infection from Milan Kuch and the specialty. And it was a knowledge by Gregor Golovich as something truly impressive the way I suffered pain uh, from drilling into nerve, a funny shit, really. So that's how far this stuff goes with the Milan Kuchan, MK Ultra, and other stuff. But this is in respect to the dents. Now I have to find the audio recording from this dentist here. Uh, it's called uh, Novlian Pushnik. Uh, this here. Uh, this is a really, really bestial people. You know, you really need to get a hold of that recording because it demonstrates that the dentist did not even hide the appetites to drive me insane during her visit, uh, visit to her, uh, to her clinic after deliberately breaking me teeth. She did everything possible during a real-time visit to her to remind me that she was the one who broke the teeth and of the promises she made that how I'm going to be poor, I'm not going to be even capable to pay for the, for the tooth. So she did this so sadistically, so toxically that I end up refusing even to have a a tooth pulled out at her dental office. So disgusting she did. And she was she 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 built entire clinic with extermination procedure, genocide against me, literally assisting Slovenian police, Nova Mesto police with infectious uh, taking out these plumps, placing them back the feelings, I don't know how you say it. Uh, she started to fuck around with this after a dentist from Zhabia Vas destroyed me one tooth. Yeah? Uh, I have two tooth destroyed. One tooth was destroyed by the by the dentist from Zhabia Vas and then there was a second one that she destroyed me deliberately. Police did order her to just destroy it, break it. Um, this first tool that was broken to me, the first tool that was broken to me, was broken to me right, right here in this location where there is a, a Hofer store that you see. There used to be a dental office there. And this dentist was again the dentist that my parents would use. And this would be again the dentist which police have selected to be the dentist of my parents. I was at the time in the United States of America. 
um, hijacked from United States of America by Central Intelligence Agency, uh, Federal Bureau investigation, delivered to Nova Mesta for torture, for physical torture, killing, uh, which one of the specialties, as I explained, was taking the plums in and out and play with infections. Uh, so, this was the dentist that police had used, along with also Zdravstveni Dom Novo Mesto, uh, to finally break the two to the such degree that when the police again anticipated, just as was the case in my taking to Poland in 2018, just as they anticipated that I would return back to Slovenia, uh, they broke the T. Basically, in a such they always do it in a such a way that they drill from inside and they make the wall very, very thin, and so the wall would just simply break off, and you have the T. You're forced to make a selection: either to take the teeth out or face a nasty. Uh, nasty, nasty, nasty infection with which they played. And so uh, I took the tooth out, what angered enormously Novo Mesto police officers with the Milan Kuchan and angered them, it raged and madness them. I remember Alexander Vucic, Serbian Chetnik. I remember Putin, I remember Russians, that they cursed me for that, uh, suggested me yeah, well, you we see you did this one, and now we're gonna see if you're gonna do the second one. So they started to actively, literally break the teeth. Before this, they used a physician, a dentist in Ecuador, uh, in Quito, where my wife, where my ex-wife is from, to literally drill the teeth, all the teeth, literally into the roots, literally into the fucking root channels. Uh, this is fucking insane, I know, but this is what Illuminati joy comes from. This is a sport. This is a joy. This is funny. It's fun. Uh, and yeah, that's what made you sleep. That's what made me sleep closer to four hours than five hours since 2018. That's bloody six years something. So now you see what Novo Mesto Police was based upon. Uh, I think it took them about four months to give me appointment at the police station this time after I complained against the director of Novo Mesto Police, against the Novo Mesto Police. In other words, I submitted the MK Ultra complaint. But really the complaint dates to year 2018. So you can see this kind of bestial practice uh, at the same time threatening you that if you will go to the dentist or you will go to whatever you will go to the physician, it will result in psychiatric hospitalization due to what the police have done against me in 2012, which was psychiatric hospitalization. So you see, this is the Illuminati. This is how they play. This is the stuff we're talking about. Naturally, I'm not too happy about the Illuminati like this and everybody who was involved in MK Ultra knows that there never ever was anybody more patient, tolerant to them than myself. They really are a scum. There is no way, there is no middle ground here. Basically, this business, either you kill them or they kill you. They are not my friends. I needed, my biggest problem was that I was so brainwashed, so washed, my brain was so brainwashed, subjected to so much violence, and in that despite my being really strong, I didn't know where to turn yourself to. When you are so abused, when you have people from European Court for Human Rights and from United Nations stating to you from Strasbourg, from Brussels, that you have no fucking chance, New York, White House, uh, unless you will la 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 la, you know, uh, the chances that you will get anywhere are really, really slender.